Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. Somebody asked me on one of my videos how to use a percentage, and I think I'm a little bit confused, but maybe this is what they're talking about. So we drew a deal and it's 100%, but we want to change it to 12 inches. Well, it's no longer 100%. So if we want to times 75%, well, times 0.75, times 0.75, it's, it's not exactly nine, it's off. I don't really understand the reasoning behind it, but what I would do in this case, matter of fact, I should have made a copy of that. And tell you what, let me make a copy of our four inch box. Or our 12, let's make it 12. All right, so it's 111%. Let's make a duplicate of that and move it over. Now this one, I'm going to times 0.75 and we get that 899. If you want to change this to be exactly nine, because you've changed the ratio up here, if you'll take the smart fill tool and fill it in, the smart fill tool makes a new object. Now we can make this 75% and it's right at nine degree or nine inches, which is the other is so close that we put them on top of each other, you can't see the difference. Well, it is, you can see the difference. It's minute, but to get a, a dimensional box that's exactly nine, and what's kind of good about this, if you take the smart fill tool and fill that in, with the smart fill tool to make a new object. You left click, right click, and then we're gonna control D and make a duplicate and reduce it to 75%. And then I control D and it's 50%, control D is 25%. So it's just a three inch circle. If you needed to know the dimensions. Oh, hope that answers the question. Thank you for watching.